go, here we go, here we go. Oh, hello. Didn't see you there. Um, welcome back. It is Rupee's Break from Reality. And today, well, I'm doing something very, very exciting. I'm going to drive to Uluru, uh, otherwise known as Ayers Rock. Um, but uh, Uluru is now the term that is used. Um, now, as you can tell, I'm English. And the distances that we kind of drive, that we moan about, are about, you know, 150, 200 miles, 300 miles, and it's like, oh, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? This one is about 1,600 miles. Yeah, 1,600. So, very sensibly, I'm splitting this up into three segments. So today, I'm driving to Port Augusta. Uh, I've never heard of it before either, so I wouldn't worry too much, but I'm sure there'll be something very exciting to do when I get there, along with some very interesting sights along to where. Now, I'm going deep into the uh, outback, so naturally I will need to cover up. You'll be very pleased to hear that I've got my uh, suntan lotion with me, um, which is... Uh, very important. Um, I will probably need to get a more sensible hat than, um, than the baseball cap that I, uh, that I currently own. Um, and I may well need to do something just to cover the rest up. Just to, you know, because I'm brown, I can't really hide that, you know, because, well, that's just genetics. Um, the teeth isn't genetics, that's just me being silly. I do need to get that fixed. So if anyone knows a good dentist along my way, do let me know. Um, anywho, so that's just genetics, but clearly I don't want to brown and just ruin the rest of the trip. So uh, I will try and find some suitable attire along the way. Right, that is it for now. Um, I'll, uh, I'll pop something else on a little bit later, and if I can fathom out, if I can work out how to do it, I'll try and do one of those little Indiana Jones type maps just to give you an idea of my route. So, toodles for now, stay safe. Uh, and, uh, actually I'm not quite sure why I said stay safe. I mean, what are you gonna be doing that's gonna be unsafe? Anyway, I hope you've all had a great Christmas. I've had a great Christmas. And now, it's time to spend New Year by an enormous rock. Yeah. Right, see you soon. So, I'm about an hour and a half in. I seem to have, when looking at the map, covered about that much distance with about that much left to go. It's going to be a long drive. But it's Australia. And, you know, it is a vast country. It's not like driving to Manchester or, uh, or even Stuttgart. Um, this is proper... These are proper distances. Interesting stat that I heard. Apparently, but turn the radio off just in case we, well, just in case we get into any uh, sound quality issues or more importantly, any copyright issues. It was an honest mistake, honest government. So anyway, interesting stat about Australia. It is a very, very big. In fact, it is so big that it is as wide as the diameter of the moon. Can you believe that? Actually, it might even be that Australia is wider than the diameter of the moon. So you could pop the moon onto, onto um, Australia and it literally wouldn't touch the edges. That's big. That's big. The only advantage is you don't have to travel 250 million miles to get there first. Um, although it does feel like I'm driving about 250 million miles, but it's not, it's not. I'm still very enthusiastic. Look. Um, oh, hello. What's going on here? I oh, know, it's just a red light. I thought it was something exciting. Anyway, I uh, must stop soon for, uh, for a coffee and I believe they call them comfort breaks. Um, thankfully, it's just not one. It's the worst case scenario. I could just help the desert out. But um, I'm 
far too high quality for that kind of nonsense. Anyway, uh, oh, hello. There's a car in the middle of the road, as it is, oh, as, uh, as they do. Uh, anyway, I will, uh, I will catch you all later. Doodles. Port Augusta and as you can see I've bought a hat do not say a word this is a health thing it's the equivalent of I don't know wearing a condom um, I'm being safe I look stupid I appreciate that I had this grand vision of me looking like I don't know Indiana Jones, um, as opposed to, oh good lord, I'm making a white pig's ear of this, uh, as opposed to um, Indian Jones, his, uh, well, let's face it, his uh, tubbier, albeit younger, um, and less adventurous sidekick. Yes. Oh, I've just worked out. I'm short round. Go ahead, my oh, thank you very much. Almost ran someone over. Talk about safe. Um, so, Port Augusta. I don't think I'll need to come back. Um, it's, uh, well, it's a little town, literally in the middle of nowhere. Um, and uh, I will do the little Indiana Jones map thing once I get back to the digs. And let me tell you, Diggs is not a misnomer. Um, yeah, anyway, but it was cheap. It's only for a night. And let's face it, this is just a stopover. Let's see what's that way. Oh, hello, that's pretty. Um, let's, uh, well, you know, we'll just see. So um, the hat, you know, it's not quite a fedora, but it's sort of got that, it's sort of got that look. So I'm just going to pretend that I look like Indiana Jones. And please, no words. If this picture gets shared everywhere, I'll be very unhappy. Um, yeah. Anyway, that's enough for now. I will uh, see you all later. Bye.